welcome back to the Road to Ruin Range Rover build. Uh, in this one, we're going to be trying to finish off the rear tyre carrier and just pretty it up and titivate it with some kegs and uh, bits and pieces. Uh, I've got a trailer board there to keep me legal just in case I cover up any of the lights and it gives me somewhere to put the number plate. Um, and we've got some timber to build a bit of a frame which we'll try to weather up a little bit and make it look the part. So uh, yeah, let's crack on. Right then, because I'm looking to weather a couple of bits, I'm just gonna mask up and get a first layer of paint on those first. That's giving me, that gives me something to be drying and working on. I'm just using a quick spot of stone chip, uh, gives decent coverage quickly. And I'm not looking for a decent finish, so I'm not really fussed. It's not a good finish, but it's just something to take away some of that glaring whiteness of the uh, trailer board. Right, next little job. Start some woodwork, shall we? Um, I did have every intention of spraying the wood to make it look pretty and then I thought um, I may as well use this. Saves any drying time and hopefully we'll look the part. Uh, hazard tape for the win. Right, I think that looks okay, and zero drying time, so can't really complain. Just got to mount the kegs, thinking cheating, and going with the simple zip tie. If it works, which it won't, because it's me. So I'm thinking something like this, just anchored up like that. Let's see if we can get this to work. I bet it won't. Ugh, it's already too short. All right, before I attach that keg completely, I'm just gonna give it a little bit of a, a weathering with some a spot of gal spray, a spot of plastic coat rust effect, and if I feel like it, I might do a touch of glow in the dark just for fun. I'm also gonna do that trailer board while I'm there. Not looking for perfection, just something to give a bit of colour <laughs> and a little bit of age. <clears throat> and I might just put that back together. Nothing to see. All intentional. Right. Thinking if I just try and catch a couple of edges. Just make it look a bit weathered. And I think that's going to spoil. Just knock this 
far off. Waste of wire ties. Pretty pleased with the effect on that. I'll quickly just do a bit of similar to the trailer board. Just using a few decking screws. Right, that's the uh, keg on. Last little job, number plate holder. There we go, not overly elegant, but I think it keeps the look. So, just demask everything, tidy up, and then uh, show you the final result. Right then, we've now tidied up, and there is the tyre carrier with the extra little decorations on.
obviously the back rack tyre carrier itself is a proper bit of kit and uh, is meant to be used for actually carrying a tyre but for the Road to Ruin Apocalypticus uh, event uh, we've not taken it too seriously there is a spare in the boot that I can use anyway it's just more a bit of a fun thing with old track tyre we found has a Tate wood um, trailer board that has come out quite effectively to be honest given that it's white plastic and I've just kind of given it a quick go over with stone chip then a bit of galvanizing spray then a little bit of uh, the rust effect spray same with the uh, keg I mean they're not perfect but it's all a bit of fun isn't it and it kind of works so uh, there we go so I think we'll uh, leave that little project there and uh, see what else we can muster if we get time anyway thanks for watching uh, cheers catch you in the next one